welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a vlog i'm really excited to bring you guys along with me i'm actually headed up to the salon i'm gonna get a little trim um i'm not gonna cut a whole lot off i'm just gonna get a trim and then i'm gonna get a brazilian blowout i am so excited i've never done any sort of treatment like that and i do obviously already have really really straight hair i'm wanting to do it more for frizz i'm in texas the humidity is insane and i've noticed this year more than any other i've had an insane amount of frizz going on so i have like always this like a layer of frizz just kind of chilling on top of like my hair and it's i'm not loving that so i'm gonna go ahead and give this a try i'm so excited you guys know i am an aveda girl i've been going to Aveda salons for years and I'm actually trying out a new location. I've never been to this location. I was really excited to try their new location. They have a new location that just opened up in the Heights. That one's not quite yet like ready and available for me to do a Brazilian blowout. So I'm going to check out the San Felipe location today. I'm really excited to get a trim and like I said, the Brazilian blowout. Then I'm going to head up to Nordstrom. I've got a couple of things that didn't work out for me. You guys know I've got to exchange one for size and then I'm just going to kind of look around to see if I can find a different trench coat. I'm really excited to bring you guys along. First up is we are going to head up to the salon. So let's go. I know the time does not can see the world when it's spinning, spinning, compensating for the moments that I spill. Wish I could fly like an airplane, airplane. Stop forsaking everything that I've done. Won't be breaking easily now. I can make it even though the lights are out. I just got here to the salon, but I'm really, really early. So I'm gonna go ahead and sit here for just a minute. I did pick up a Starbucks. I had to, I couldn't help myself. I couldn't. So I did pick up a, ch a chai tea a latte. You guys know I'm obsessed. So I'm gonna go ahead and sit here, drink this, probably pop up a quick Instagram post, maybe chat with you guys a little bit on Snapchat, and then I'm gonna go inside. Mm -hmm. Coffee cups and cigarettes laying around the room. I don't mind a little mess. Just want to stay with you ooh, ooh, and we'll do anything that we want today. Won't be scared of falling down no more. Oh, oh. So take me away to some other place. Don't want to wait. Oh, my Indian summer. Take me away. I ain't afraid. Calling your name. Oh, my Indian summer.
our best to hide Innocence fading away As we learn the truth And we'll be anything That we wanna be Gonna get what's coming in
I love that it's just like, it looks really natural. I'm obsessed. It did, I did have a little bit of eye irritation, just wanna be honest with you guys. I did have a little bit of eye irritation, which you saw they put those little glasses on me, which were kind of funny, it was so cute. But you guys know how much I love my Aveda salons. I have been an Aveda girl for years, but this location was by far the nicest Aveda salon I have ever been into. It was huge. It had a huge variety of products, which I love. And I love that each like, each section was kind of separated off. I was just really, really impressed with this location. They actually just opened up a new location out in the Heights, which that's the one that I was trying to go to. I really wanted to go to that one because it's brand spanking new and it's gorgeous. Um, so I wasn't able to go to that one today, but they did invite me to a white linen night that is Saturday, August 5th. I'm gonna try to make that. Saturdays are kind of difficult with for me with the boys, but I'm gonna try to go because I really, really wanna go. And they're giving me like goodies and gift bags and all that kind of stuff. So hopefully I can make it to that. Oh, I love the way my hair turned out. She did my hair so beautiful. I love her. I'll put her information below. So if you're in the Houston area, check her out. She was so, 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 so sweet. And if you guys go to the White Linen Night, let me know because maybe we'll I'll see you there. And she did my cut so well. I really love it. And I tried to get take a little bit of coverage of everything because I know I get a lot of you guys that ask what kind of cut I have. This time she did use a razor and I'm glad she did because it already looks blended instead of looking choppy. I know that you either like the razor cut or you don't. I happen to love it. I just think it looks a little bit more worn in, a little bit more natural immediately instead of having to wait a couple of days for it to look a little bit more blended. So I love it. But the blowout was nice. Like I said, I did get a little bit of eye irritation kind of like spurts of it. It wasn't constant, but I did get spurts of eye irritation. But I had done some research before I came out here and before I was having this done, so I knew I was gonna possibly have some eye irritation. I also happen to have really sensitive eyes, so I kind of expected it. Um, I did end up buying the Brazilian Blowout Shampoo Conditioner in the mask. Just a heads up, it was kind of pricey, but if this is a pricey treatment and I think that if you're gonna have something like this done, you need to kind of have the right products, right? So let me show you what I picked up. Um, I did get the 
this is the conditioner so I did get the conditioner that she used on me I also bought the shampoo and then I bought the mask so I know I'm gonna have a lot of people ask what I'm using on my hair I will be using this on my hair for pretty much while I have this blowout it's supposed to last anywhere from three to six months and this is just gonna kind of help a lot like help it last a little longer basically she said and I had read this before in the research that I had did basically she said you need to use a sulfate free shampoo and conditioner technically you could just buy that at the grocery store or whatnot the drugstore but since it was my first time I went ahead and splurged and got the products and I'm just curious to see how well and how long this lasts but I love it my hair feels so smooth so smooth and I just think it looks really really good so I'm excited to see she said that I can let it air dry and it's gonna look this straight after air dry and even though I have naturally straight hair when I let it air dry I do get like weird kind of waves in it not like waves like curls waves just like from my ear and from my neck and things like that you know what I'm saying so it just doesn't look straight like this so I'm really excited to see that but let's go ahead and head we're gonna head up to the mall I need to go by Nordstrom and get a different size in one shirt and exchange the trench coat that I showed you in my Nordstrom haul but let's go ahead and head up to the mall. Run a thousand miles if I could run with you the same thing too I want to say forever we could be good together guess misery loves company better to late than never you know we could do better so take a chance and run with me everywhere we I didn't spend a lot of time in there honestly lately it's been really overwhelming with the cell going on it's just there's nothing available and there's so many people in there and it's just really overwhelming for me kind of gives me anxiety and so I didn't spend a lot of time in there I was able to order a couple of tops that one aren't available online and also weren't in store so they ordered them from another location and then I also found the booties that I've been wanting so I can't wait to get those in the mail he had to order them and share with you what I picked out I did pick up a pair of these um, foot pedals I ordered these they were like our box 
bought these. They were like $10, these little foot pedals. I got them to go on my Christian Louboutin original Pigals. You guys know I've been talking about putting something in those. So I'm excited that I got those to try, but I hope you guys enjoyed kind of tagging along. I had a fun day. It was a long day. I know I didn't go a lot of places, but I spent a lot of time at the salon and I hope you guys enjoyed kind of seeing that. I get a ton of questions about my hair. So I thought it would be really, really nice to kind of show you one, how she cut my hair, um, the products that she used. And then also, I also wanted to kind of, I've never done a Brazilian blowout. It was my very first time. And I'm sure that a lot of people are curious about the process. So I thought it would be nice to kind of document the process. It's, I really did enjoy it. The only complaint that I had was I did have a little bit of eye irritation, but it was, it only lasted for a little bit and it wasn't like constant. It was just like sporadic spurts of it. Um, but I think that the results so far are worth it. I'm really curious to see what it's like. I'm not going to wash my hair tomorrow, but I'll probably wash my hair Sunday or Monday. I'm really curious to see how it air dries. And I just love the way it turned out, but I'm not kidding. If you guys are in the Houston area. If I have any local people that are for sure going to go see Sarah, send me an email and I will mail you these cards. Right. So send me an email, lux underscore mommy at yahoo.com. If you're for sure going to go and I'll mail you, um, I'll mail you that little, that little gift certificate, like a refer a friend type of thing. But she was awesome. That salon was amazing. I cannot wait to go see the Heights location. I'm going to try to make it to the white linen night. So if you guys are local, definitely check that out on August 5th. I'm really excited, but I had blast. Thank you guys so much for spending the day with me, and I will see you guys in my next video. Talk to you soon.